The Daikin EHU series has a lot of tools available to us to help diagnose and troubleshoot errors or problems. This unit has the ability to tell us when oil is low, when voltage is incorrect, uh, when temperatures are too high. The di digital display here in the front has four buttons. To, to access our monitor mode, we'll push the menu key and hold it down for two seconds. It will then flash N00. Using your up arrow, you can scroll up to N03 and hit enter, the backwards O. That'll show you your actual flow rate through the pump. If you scroll up to N05, you will get your motor RPM or motor speed at an idle. N10 will give you motor temperature and N12 will give you your control board voltage. All of these are helpful when diagnosing this system. And if you're having trouble or calling for technical support, it's always great to have those values or that information readily available so we can quickly work through troubleshooting. If your Daikin EHU is displaying an E41 alarm, this is an indication that your motor temperature has exceeded 85 degrees Celsius. There are several factors that can contribute to this. First thing we need to check is that our fan, our cooling fan is rotating and is not plugged. Second thing will be our heat exchanger. This needs to be clear as well, allowing air to flow over the motor through the heat exchanger and out the fan. If everything appears correct and clean here, the next thing we need to check is our motor RPM. Potentially, our motor RPM was not set correctly at installation, or there has been a change in your circuit, such as a leaking actuator or valve that's allowing continuous flow of oil through the system. This will raise your motor RPM, ultimately generating more heat. Remember, after any alarm has been displayed or occurred and you've made an adjustment to the unit, you will need to cycle power to reset that alarm. Most alarms will not go away after you change a parameter or setting. We'll turn off power, wait about 10 seconds, and then restart.